We're back in that cold, albeit now kind of hot, I suppose, but familiar darkness, everyone. Hello, lights out. And as we pass by and look at possibly three boss arenas, because I kind of forgot Claw spawn so close to, yeah, we have to talk about this bee queen. Going after her with the group of bunnies, Pikmin, and Beeflo sounds absolutely hilarious. Then again, what if we kind of stuck to our... Oh, you're not going to be happy with me. What if we stuck to our rule set a little bit more and had fun with the mechanics of Lights Out that could still lead us to a lot of carrots? That said, it won't be a lot of carrots fast, so it's not like we're going to be able to do this method today, potentially. Get out of my way, light bugs. Uh, but it's still going to be, like I said, a fun in-house, in-rule set way to go about doing things. And what if I told you that this one way of going about things, of going about the thing that I'm on about, would actually lead to birds, seeds, and an actual working farm in a world that has zero lights? And what if I told you that this whole time we've been going on about cat coons of all things? Oh, you're gonna try to kill my dudes, but hopefully not when I do this. All right, oh, yep, never mind, you definitely are. <laughs> Okay, well, we might have to say goodbye to Harry, Gary, and Jerry uh, upon doing this method. By the way, are you not going to hack anything up, my dude? Do I have to feed you twice? Might have to feed you twice. Yes, there we go. All right. All right. Yes, everybody. <laughs> Our uh, potential bee queen nonsense is coming down to, uh, to a cat coon. Of all things. Only problem, it doesn't seem to be working all that efficiently as it normally does. That's kind of annoying. Why are you not hacking up more often, my dude? Ah, now it's working. I don't know. Maybe it was just he was too nearby a bunch of things. Okay, now this is working though, everybody. You feed the thing like this. You walk away a little bit. It's going to hopefully start walking towards you. You walk back. Here we go. This is what I was expecting, everyone. This is what I was expecting. Okay. That's not, not what I want. <laughs> Come on. Be nice to us. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do a lot of fishing here. Okay. Gave us potato seeds. I mean, I'm not going to say no to potatoes. Potatoes are bloody amazing in this game. Oh, my gosh. It actually did it. Carrot seeds. <laughs> He gave me a carrot seed. Okay, if I get myself a bird, any type of bird, because it can hack up literally any type at any time, and then maybe get one more seed, that's actually okay. I can, like, actually work with that. It coughed up a tumbleweed. Oh, my gosh, I love it. Cacoons, man. <laughs> Cacoons are so fun just to see what they're going to hack out. Well, I'll tell you what. If I was going for potatoes, I'd be a happy man because this thing keeps giving me potatoes. But ironically enough, the hardest thing is probably going to be normal seeds to actually make a birdcage. Uh, yeah, yeah. A butterfly? You hawked up a live butterfly. Oh my gosh. Cacoons are hilarious. But they also don't play very nice. Hmm. That was my first round of cat cooning, let's call it. And yeah, yeah. I got one carrot seed. Hey, one carrot seed, I guess, is better than nothing. If I take care of this one carrot, though, could turn it big, get two, turn two into four, yada, yada, yada. So, you know, all's potentially not lost here. Yeah, now that's got me thinking. I might not actually need a bird. Hmm. <laughs> if I can just forego taking care of any other crop apart from carrots, just solely focus on carrots yeah i think i could probably make giant crops alone and then just multiply carrots over and over and over again hmm. <laughs> yeah let's uh let's see if we can get that done ah shoot i had a sneaking suspicion this was going to be the case but i was really hoping it wasn't bulb is light bug light does not count as natural light oh okay um i guess that means I need myself a star caller staff. So while we prepare for a mini trip down to the ruins, let's talk how there could have been another way to get some seeds. That is, if I found the Lunar Island. Yes, carrots, everybody. If I would have found the Lunar Island, had some carrots, they have a 33% chance to drop some carrot seeds specifically. That's not great, Especially when cat coons actually do have a better chance, even though I only got one, mind you. But yeah, that could have been another way. But yeah, you know what? 
the more I think about it, the more I'm actually kind of confused as to why bulbous light bugs don't count as natural lights. But if we are indeed doing a somewhat ruins clear in the search of some yellow gems, we are going to need ourselves some healing. And since I don't really have the big meat to get myself some serpent turf, I'm just going to go ahead and use some spider loot, get myself some healing salves, everybody. Which means I got to go mining. Holy meteor field, everybody. Wow, this has been a very active one, let me tell you, because there are scorch marks everywhere. Okay, I also came to this one for the exact reason to find meteors, because you never know. The suspicious boulder might have landed at this point. Oh, and welcome to autumn, everybody. Ooh, and it's a full day of a full moon. Oh, frick me. <laughs> okay, maybe, uh, maybe this is... Not the greatest place to be right now. Holy moly, these meteors have been uprooting bloody everything. This field is massive, man. But look, everybody, carrots. Oh my goodness, I found carrots. Oh, we have a second meteor field here in the mosaic, everybody. All right, that's good. Doubles our chances, hopefully, of getting this suspicious boulder. Never mind, I just found it while I was talking about it. Okay, uh, let's talk about something else then. We're not here just for this thing and for rocks for the, uh, you know, upcoming healing down in the caves. No, 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 no. I also want rocks for a an eventual bee queen slash dragonfly. I'm, I'm brain is broken because I found the thing I was talking about while I was actually talking about it. Okay, we want rocks not only for healing, but also for dragonfly. Because depending on how things go today, we might just do a dragonfly. All right, well, that was a wildly successful trip. <laughs> I was not anticipating coming away with something that is absolutely essential for the end game on day 72 on a casual rock trip, but hey, we will take it. And heck, if I get some more green gems, this is two more houses. Two is greater than one last I checked. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, things might be coming together here. And you know, I ain't gonna go it alone. Oh my gosh. I don't know why these guys can't fly over gaps. You know what I mean? Why can't they not fly over gaps? I'm not gonna go it alone, folks. I'm gonna bring some rock lobster friends, I believe. Cause here's what I'm hoping as well. Nightmare Cycle, Splue Monkey Farm, right? It is very difficult for Maxwell to farm Nightmare Fuel. Then again, we did just kill Antlion last week. Therefore, I can kind of just make myself insane. I can also make some Nightmare Amulets, yada, yada, yada. But two birds, one stone sort of deal. Look at how much we still need to explore here. I haven't even found the Labyrinth either. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think rolling up with the posse to make this as efficient and quick and safe as possible, because I might be down here a long time, is uh, is good for a character with only 75 health. They are slow though, let me tell ya. But 3600 health, a way to just like take zero damage when they go into their safety mode and 90 damage, yeah, yeah, I'd say it's worth the wait. And so it begins, everyone. Hey, you want to run into my insanely powerful rock lobster friends, my dude? Nope, you're just going to miss them entirely. Sure, that works. Oh, he just killed all of my bulbous light bugs in one thing. <laughs> okay, well, time to go the more traditional light route, I suppose. Also, I just lost those gears, so thank goodness I actually don't need to use them all that much. Hey, have we found Hutch in this playthrough? Hmm. If we did not I didn't bring him, that was an unfortunate tactical error, actually. But, 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 all I'm really here for, honestly. Oh, I didn't bring down anything to actually make the staff. Right. Well, looks like this is going to be like a two-part trip. This is the gather the resources trip, and then the next trip is the make the thing that I actually came down here to make trip. Sound good? Sound good. Also, slight problem, don't leave the gems on the ground when you're next to the rock lobsters because they freaking eat them. <laughs> Whoops. Good thing I didn't need those uh, uh, red and blue gems there. Well, they fight the clockworks, I'll fight the nightmares. Fair trade, fair trade. Oh my, I have hammered now five of these things in one go, and this is the first gem they gave. All of them just gave these uh, trinkets. Oof. Not great odds right now. Yeah, as smooth as this is gone, we're not actually getting what we're looking for. Not even a single yellow gem yet. Hmm, 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 hmm. 
Well, got a green gem from this guy at least. Okay, okay, making me feel a little better about things. Depth worm wave. Okay, fine, fine, fine. This is pretty much what these guys are built for. There's another. There's another. All right, uh, we have cleared pretty much all of this, apart from breaking one of these ancient pseudo science stations. Thankfully, look how much we have left. <laughs> If we don't get a yellow gem out of this, heck, at least a couple, then, uh, well, I guess it just wasn't meant to be. Holy moly, rock lobsters are so unbelievably good. <laughs> so, so flippin' good. I'll tell you what, I keep getting bloody orange gems, though. My gosh, three orange gems, not a single yellow yet. I also haven't even gotten a blue now that I think about it. Mm -hmm. Might have used, uh, might have used all my luck on getting those green gems two parts ago here. Oh my gosh, another freaking orange. <gasps> okay, I got another orange. I got two oranges, but I finally got a freaking yellow. Oh my gosh, it took forever. <laughs> it took forever, but we finally got one, one yellow to five orange gems, everybody. <laughs> five orange gems. What the heck am I going to use five orange gems for? You know, I find it odd that we can recruit these guys with minerals, right? And they heal from minerals, but we can't heal them with minerals. Yeah, I don't know why I just thought about that right now, after all these years. The heck is this doing here? Okay, found another one just lying on the frickin' ground. We'll take it. <laughs> Bloody heck, apparently another. Did I, like, not pick these up the last time we were down here? Was I only going for greens? I just left the yellows on the ground? Okay, alright. Now we're rolling in the gems that we're looking for. <gasps> just gave me another green. Oh my gosh. If this plan comes together, everybody, it's gonna be the greatest freaking plan in all plans. Oh boy, here we go again. Okay, okay, okay. You guys fight the uh, clockworks, I fight the nightmares. Once again, fair trade. Unless, of course, more than half of you want to sleep. Yeah, that's not gonna help my situation here. Oh, I see another green gem. Oh my gosh, everybody, this was amazing. This trip was so bloody worth it. And I actually got one last yellow gem. I shouldn't say last, I mean, we actually still got one little thing over here. You know what? I'm actually surprised. Where's the labyrinth? The labyrinth must be somewhere up here. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, that's probably it. That lichen right there might be leading to the labyrinth. Hmm. Don't think we're going after the Ancient Guardian today. No, 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 no. My plan was to come down here, do a full ruins clear, which we kind of pretty much did. We're just right on the cups of that. Go back up. Check to see if this is actually going to work, because if it doesn't work, I'm going to cry. And then we'll see about wrapping up. And you might be saying, wrap it up? What do you mean? You didn't really do too much today, Beard. Well, like I said, this playthrough is not going to be rushing to every single boss fight immediately, trying to get done as quickly as possible. No, no, no. That's what some of the other playthroughs lately have been doing. With this one at first person, I mean, I want to slow things down a little bit. I want to play the game. And who are you to say we didn't do anything? We bloody cleared the ruins with rock lobsters today. Oh my goodness, I can't necessarily tell. No, that's not another green. Greens are usually more distinct than that, but hmm, it might just be because we're in the uh, calm phase. Yeah, or the dawn phase, I mean, of the nightmare cycle. And I can't necessarily tell. Are you guys gonna fight? Oh my gosh, you're almost gonna die, my friend. Uh, no, we're gonna lose one of our friends. Oh, that is something you don't often see. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. It was a yellow. Oh, my goodness, everybody. <laughs> I am a happy beard all right now. No, don't eat this. It's mine. Here I was concerned. Not going to be able to find any yellows. I'm going to walk out of here with five yellows, everybody. Unfreaking believable. Unfreaking believable. Okay. I also have all of this stuff, too. The problem is, like I said, I don't have the materials to make this stuff, but that's okay. We'll head on home, then I have a safe journey. It's a long journey, but it's a safe journey. Just back to this guy, which is our fully... Oh. Hold up. I haven't even found the real ancient pseudoscience station yet. Hold up. There might be an entire branch of the ruins that we just... Haven't found yet. I also just realized there's very little point in bringing any of these trinkets up because the fat man himself, the pig king, is constantly sleeping in this playthrough. So I can't even trade any of it for gold. I'd only be able to trade it to, you know, ant lion, cat coons, yada yada yada. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, the cat coo thing is actually pretty tempting. As I said, that's our ticket to maybe a bird and more carrot seeds if needed. But... It's not like any of these things despawn on us. 
could just leave it. The gears, yeah. But, yeah, look at all this. <laughs> I am not gonna bring these out today. Yup! Found it, everybody. Another set of ruins. Hmm, how big are we talking, though? An actual legit set. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't really have the food to sustain myself down here, but, oh my goodness gracious. Also, there's a labyrinth in the top left there. Oh my, okay, um, yeah. I'm thinking we should probably go home, uh, gather a bunch of stuff again, and come right back down. Oh, but the trip home was worth it just for this. Actually found the guy. Okay, this is gonna make the next trip a heck of a lot easier. And total side note, but I absolutely love that I disabled Insight telling me all these indicators because I've walked past him now four times coming back to these ruins, you know, back and forth, back and forth to find him just natural like this. Oh, so much better. It helps the gameplay experience instead of the game saying, hey, he's right here. Don't miss him. It is kind of unfortunate that I found him on the way home and not really on the way there because, yeah, the biggest reasons why we had to come home, honestly, were our storage and weapon situation. I could have just eaten lichen that whole time. I would have been fine with the sanity hit, you know what I mean? I'm bloody Maxwell. Yeah, now I gotta go through this whole process. But whatever, it won't take that long. In fact, we're back already with a slightly bigger group of rocky friends. Hey, remember all those rocks I said we were gonna use for uh, the dragonfly too? Yeah, yeah, kind of a change of plans there. But hopefully, hopefully with this bigger group, We'll be able to take down these guys a little faster so that we're not here all day because I've kind of already been here all day. Oh, we might also consider going after the rumbling, bumbling, stumbling ancient guardian, but mm, I think, I think, I think, I think a ruins clear is the goal today. Oh my, another green gem. Okay, we like that, we like that. Oh baby, another yellow. Okay, at this rate, I don't need more yellows. I will take more greens. Also don't need any more purples, cause my gosh, we got a lot of purples. But look at that, four green, six yellow, five orange, whoo. Okay, actually I'm gonna take some of these reds. Reds aren't needed either. I can just feed these to my guys to recruit them if need be. Cause yeah, yeah. Feeding them rocks and gold nuggets. Not the best thing in the world. This is probably gonna be the most damage I've taken all day between this. Ooh, come on, rock lobsters, you're so freaking slow. <laughs> you're so, so slow. Yeah, honestly, this is the most damage, but I barely use any bloody armor or healing sounds. We'll be good, we'll be good, we'll be fine. Mark it, another orange, everybody. My goodness gracious. <gasps> That's an, oh, I thought that was a green. Nope, nope, in the shadows, it still looked like a green. It's a blue. You know what? We'll take a blue. We'll take a blue. Another yellow, good stuff. All right, this might be the last pocket, everybody. This might be the last pocket. You know what? Screw you, red gems. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just mining these, hopefully for the good gems, but also for big Thulesite chunks. Another green gem. Oh my goodness gracious. This might be it, folks. This might be the last branch, I'm thinking. Another green. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, it can't be the last one because I still haven't even found the legit ancient pseudoscience station yet. Okay, we need to find that thing and then yeah, we're done for the day. Found it! Alright, as I suspected, this final branch up here. And then this, ooh, there might be even more up there. Oh my gosh, everybody. I don't know if I can keep doing this. <laughs> this is a two and a half hour recording. This is probably an insanely long video. Oh my gosh, this was like the greatest ruins clear of all freaking time. It was so big, we're still not even done. When we come back next week, we will finish this up. We will craft what we need to craft. If our guys are still loyal to us, I even forgot that over there. <laughs> we we will go ahead and maybe take down the Ancient Guardian, and then we'll move on from there. We might be able to farm carrots next week, become carrot farmers next week. Oh my goodness, what a day. What a day. Thank you for joining with me. I Words, words are hard after so long of recording. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.